On my last camping trip, I forgot to bring a lamp. So first, I tried to make one from sticks. Yeah, not the best idea. So I designed and 3D printed my own solar lamp. Multifunctional, bright and simple to use. And the best part, you can build it too. But let's start from the beginning. I love camping. And on my last trip, like always, I first set up the tent and enjoyed the beautiful view. But then the sun went down and I realized something. It was dark and I didn't have a lamp. The next day I remembered that in my bag I still had a small solar module from an old project. And I started thinking about how I could turn it into the perfect outdoor lamp. Back home in the workshop I got started right away. Here are three reasons why this solar light unit is perfect for my project. First, it charges itself with solar power. Second, it's designed for outdoor use. And third, it's lightweight but still bright enough for camping or outdoor use. And just as a teaser, if you prefer USB-C and rechargeable batteries, I'll show you another option at the end of this video. But your first question might be, how do you turn a simple solar light unit into a real functional camping lamp? Here's how. After my first idea completely failed, I asked myself what I really need from a camping lamp. First, it should be robust, but still lightweight. Second, I want to be able to place it anywhere. Third, I need to hang it inside the tent. Fourth, the battery has to last at least a few hours at night. Fifth, I want a handle so I can carry it around in the dark. Many hours later, and after several iterations and failed attempts, I finally arrived at this design. The solar light unit fits into a frame. This frame is connected with two movable arms to a second frame. And that second frame works as a stand, a hook and also as a handle. Now let's print the final version and test how well this lamp actually works. By the way, you can actually build all of my projects yourself. You'll find the files and extras on my Kofi page, including behind the scenes material. And if you're curious about the tools and materials I used, I've linked everything down in the description. Since I had a small issue during printing and had to reprint a few parts, I took the time to come up with three improvements. First, I designed this cover. It gives the lamp a much cleaner and smarter look, but it does reduce the brightness a little. Then I thought a USB-C version would be great. While searching online, I found this light that's usually mounted under cabinets. It's actually perfect for our lamp, since it includes all the features we'd want, though it isn't waterproof. And finally, I realized the lamp could also be super useful in the workshop. So I printed this magnetic base, which allows you to attach the lamp almost anywhere. But now, after many hours of watching the printer do its job, it's finally time to assemble the outdoor solar lamp and put it to the test. I'm really excited about how these solar lamps turned out. Since all the parts are interchangeable, I also tested the USB-C version right away. But do these lamps actually meet all the requirements I set for them? Let's find out. Is it robust and still lightweight? Yes. The choice of material makes a big difference here. And for a stronger version, I'd recommend PET GCF or something similar. Can I place it anywhere? Yes, thanks to the stand and the many mounting options. Can I hang it inside a tent? Yes, I integrated a small loop so you can easily hang it up. Does the battery last long enough? Yes, in my test the lamp ran for more than 8 hours. Of course, that depends a lot on the solar unit you use. Is there a handle for carrying? Yes. The bottom frame works not only as a stand, but also doubles as a handle. So in conclusion, I'm super happy with this DIY camping solar lamp and can definitely recommend the project to anyone. You'll find all further details in the description.
Thanks for watching my video. I really appreciate every comment, like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next one.